Hey loves, it's Marie Regal and you're tuned into The Mo Show, where I aspire to inspire your mind, body, and soul. And today we're going to be doing a little stretching. This is kind of some of the stretches that I do to give me like the ultimate flexibility. I typically do these stretches after I do a workout. So it's like I do my workout cardio and then I do legs or abs or something else during the day. And then I'll end with stretches for flexibility, kind of get my muscles moving, kind of get them a little unstiff because depending on the workout, they'll be a little stiff. So I'm just going to show you guys about four, three to four minutes of stretches that I do. And it can go longer or shorter depending on if you do the stretch for 30 seconds or you do it for a minute. I usually do it for 30 seconds, but if I haven't stretched in a while, I'll go ahead and push each stretch to a minute just to be sure. So come along. Okay, so I'm going to get started on my stretches. And I do have my phone because I use my eyes. Stopwatch. Oh, you can see it. We'll do like 30 seconds for each one. And let me pause that because I do have a playlist. So playlists are very important when you're stretching or when you're working out period. It just kind of gives you that motivation to do what you're trying to do. So I have my Kehlani playlist going right now. So. We'll stretch to her for a few minutes. Okay, so we're gonna do 30 seconds bent over to the right leg, 30 seconds to the left, 30 seconds to the middle, and we'll keep going from there. Let me get my timer ready. And then we'll stop and we'll transition over to the left side. We'll go to the middle. And then we'll roll our shoulders back. And then we'll go down to the middle like this and keeping our core kind of tight here. And we'll lean over and we'll kind of really get in that groin area, get that part stretched out too. Okay, next we'll sit down on the floor because we get all of our standing up stretches. We'll do our arms. Really breathe in and kind of feel it. Then we'll go to the right side. Bring it up to the left side. And really like push yourself, like get in there as far as you can go without straightening yourself. Go as far as you can. That'll give you the best stretches. Then we'll pull up and we'll go to the middle. And I usually grab my feet, grab my toes, just so I can kind of hold on to something, you know. And once you kind of get the hang of it, you can kind of pull yourself up on your legs so you can go down as far as you can, you know. And then we'll do the butterfly, which is one of my favorites. And I used to be able to have to keep my legs all the way up right here. Like, this is not going to give you the ultimate groin stretch like you need, so you kind of have to like... Flatten them out. You can pull your legs out a little bit in front of you and then just kind of push on these, push on the sides of your legs so they can go as flat to the ground as possible. 
So really get in there and stretch those legs and pull them out so they can flatten down to the ground. And make sure you're breathing. That is very, very important to breathe while you're stretching. Inhale and exhale all the time. Okay, and you can kind of add in whatever stretches after that you want. That's like the core of my ultimate flexibility morning stretches that I do or after workout stretches that I do. And I usually do a split after that, but I won't show that in this video. But yeah, I usually try to sit and hold into my split because that kind of gives me a little bit more leg flexibility for the day. And then it just kind of is like a challenge to me, like see how long I can sit in my split forever. So you can kind of just use those as a baseline for what you do. You know, get your arms worked out, of course. I mean, get your arms stretched out and do all those leg stretches that I showed you. And kind of add your own in there based off of what your body needs. Like sometimes you may need a back stretch. You know, you can do that. You can kind of lay over the floor and do a back stretch. Or, you know, you can research and look up other things that will just kind of help you to get the body goals that you want. So... I hope this video was helpful. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys for watching. I'm really here to inspire you. So this is like the body part of the mind, body, and soul. So stay tuned for my next videos. I'll be doing a workout video soon. I'll be doing a vlog soon. I'll be doing um, a book review soon. So a lot of things are coming to my channel. So just stay tuned. Thank you guys. Bye.